hello guys in today's video i'm going to show you uh, how to um, fix the problem of touchpad in acer laptops uh, specifically it's uh, a common issue and i've struggled a lot with this thing this time because uh, i didn't know how to do it and i've tried my best i've tried every possible suggestions given on the uh, google but it didn't work for me so what uh, did work for me and I think this is the ultimate solution for that because it's tricky like you know the way you follow the things that matters you know like if you are gonna see the drivers first of all you have to keep in mind that these things are in interconnected once you upload the uh, update the drivers you have to look for it in the BIOS as well I'll show you guys like do it step by step first of all just make it sure uh, uh, on the keyboard I'll, I'll show you guys there are two buttons you can see fn and f7 in my case you can see here's a touchpad so you can press fn and press f7 once and if your touchpad is come back your uh, uh, eraser is come back then it's fine like you are lucky and that is the most simple one but in in other cases like if this was not an issue then the second one, uh, my suggestion will be to, uh, the problem I got was just because of uh, the upgrade from Windows 8 to Windows 10. In that case, uh, my system was not recognizing my touchpad hardware. So in that case, you have to um, update your drivers. Uh, for that, you have to go to uh, Acer, uh, like, um, official website and uh, find the model of your uh, laptop uh, and then search for that model on the um, Acer website so Acer driver download the first link this one you can go here and enter if S1511 this is the model of my laptop so it'll pop up with uh, this window if you're using Windows 10 select Windows 10 if you're using Windows 8 select Windows 8 now let's select Windows 8 and drivers in drivers if even if if yeah there's one more thing in Windows 10 drivers are not that many but the one we are looking for that is in Windows 8 one so you can even download this one so download the touchpad driver download it and install this driver it's a zip file unzip it and unzip it and install this driver after installing this driver what you guys can do you can restart your computer it'll ask you to restart your computer so in that case restart your computer and i'll show you guys after restarting your computer what you guys are gonna do you guys have to go to bio setting and bio setting you have to enable um, option i'll show you guys there because that is really important i was making this mistake again and again i was trying i was struggling with it go to bios f2 Oh, I've missed it I have to restart it again and I'll, I'll, I'll uh, get you guys back or l let's do it this way like a short way F2 go to BIOS go to main in main you have to come back here touchpad now it is basic it's working but if it is advanced in your case that is an issue but the important thing is that before downloading that drivers my touchpad was not here so that was something you know uh, more troubler because uh, if I didn't find my hardware here how can I uh, enable and disable your uh, from advanced to basic so after uh, updating that driver like downloading that driver and installing it you have to come back here and see if your touchpad is here or not if it's not here then it's uh, hard your hardware is not here so you can't do anything in that case I I'll suggest you have to go to the same website you have to go to the same website like the Acer um, uh, drivers one and you have to download uh, touchpad there there is a um, BIOS update uh, file 
for touchpad like how to improve the touchpad uh, functionality on your laptop and you have to download that file and in that file if you install that uh, BIOS file you will you will see your touchpad here hundred percent so that's how let's my laptop uh, comes up and then I'll show you guys that file So you have to go to your browser and in the browser you have to go to Acer uh, official website for the drivers. the solution and it took me one night and one day like complete 24 hours to find the solution for that so you have to download Acer support drivers and manuals you have to go inside and you have to again uh, put your uh, model of your computer 5 this is the one Acer E15 for me and now you can see here BIOS uh, firmware so there are four files this is the one improved touchpad detection behavior download this one close everything on your computer and install this uh, firmware and and after installing it and rest, re, uh, restarting your laptop you can go to bios setting again and see if your touchpad is there and it will be there 100 percent this time and just make it uh, basic from the advanced one and now your touchpad is will work after restarting thank you so much for watching this video